Yo, what's up, guys, girls, and third graders? My name is Jordan from Oregon, and this is day three of the Righteous Empire, which is my hardcore world. So, uh, yeah. That was quick. In this video, I'm gonna turn this boring oak box into something special. Wait till the end of the video to find out what it is. Alright, I just gotta get that announcement out of the way. So anyways, I think the first thing I'm gonna do is, uh, add a little log frame on the outside of this house. I'm gonna use birch wood, because, uh, why not? So now, if you look at the hot, hot bar, you can see how many birch- Oh, jeez! Come here, creepy boy! Alright. So anyways, if you look at the hot bar, you can see how much birch logs I have right now. I think we're going to go for a stack and a half, just like we did on the oak planks. Sounds pretty reasonable. This is a really nice looking biome. I actually really like this biome for some reason. I think it's just the flowers, or the shade of grass. Alright, so I think we're almost out of birch trees within uh, this little forest, so I'm going to have to find a new forest nearby. But luckily, I did collect a birch sapling, so in case I ever do run out of uh, birch trees, I can just grow new ones with the birch sapling. I think there's only two more birch trees within this tiny little forest area. And one of them has a beehive, so I'm just going to mine the one that doesn't have a beehive. So that way I don't bother the bees. Alright, so that's all the birch logs within this entire area. I know there's that tree, but that tree also has a beehive. And like I said, I don't want to bother the birch trees. So we're going to have to find a new forest, and it looks like I see one all the way over there. So we're going to have to head to the... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, Patrick, do you want to go jellyfishing? Oh, uh, yes, yeah, SpongeBob. Let's go jellyfishing. Yay, this sounds so much fun. Hey, SpongeBob. Hey, Patrick, can you please shut up while I try and get rejected from art school? Now, I can't... I would show you the coordinates, but I can't because the F3 key on my keyboard is broken. Which is why I have a giant tower to find my base. Oh, yeah, I forgot there's a pillager outpost right next to the forest. That might be a bit of a problem, because then pillagers might attack us, but, uh, let's just hope they don't. Jeez, oh, that pillager outpost is closer than I thought. But we'll be fine, I think. Alright, we just made it to the forest, and now I'm chopping off all these trees. Just don't tell Camman18 to watch this video, because he's going to hate the fact that I'm mining birch. And Camman18 does not like birch at all. Alright, my stone axe is about to break, but luckily I can just craft a new one by literally just digging a few blocks deep. And then, yep, new stone axe. Literally the easiest thing ever in Minecraft. Okay, so we're almost at one and a half stacks of birch logs. I think we just gotta mine a few more trees and we should be good. I also plan on releasing a new Fortnite wrap pretty soon. It's going to come out this weekend, hopefully. And we just reached a stack and a half of birch logs, so now we have to head back to my base. Which is kind of far away, but... Yeah, you can still see the giant monstrosity tower that I built. Okay, so we've officially made it back to the base, as you can see over there. And also by the giant tower that I built. So here's what I'm going to do with these logs. I'm going to place one log on the corner like this. And then I'm just going to build like a little frame on the outside of these walls. Um, crap. There we go. Now it, 
I know what you're thinking. Oh, this looks ugly. Well, it's not going to look ugly. Because I'm going to strip these logs so they look less ugly. Alright. Nice. Bur <laughs> okay. Oh, we just accidentally built a little bit too far. Alright, watch this. This is about to be the biggest clutch in history. Nice. Okay, so we're almost out of birch logs in one of my hot bar slots, but luckily we have some more birch logs in another one of my slots. Oh my god. Okay. Time to do another one of those epic clutches I did earlier. Oompa, loompa, doompa dee doo. I got a bad feeling about you. Oh jeez, I'm I'm out of I'm almost out of birch logs. Oh, we don't have enough birch logs to fill in the whole thing. Oh, it's okay. I'll just mine like one or two. I'll, I'll mine three more trees. How about that? I think I'll go for about. Hmm, I'll go for sixteen birch logs. Oh yeah, there's the salmon that I killed. I'm just gonna take that. Let's see if I can kill another one just for fun. Oh jeez, I'm gonna drown. Never mind. Okay, that was a close one. Is it just me, or is it really scary drowning in video games? Like, I remember when I was little and I was playing Super Mario 64 on the Nintendo 64. And, like, there's this one part called Jolly Roger Bay, and, like, like most of that place was underwater. Like, that's where you got most of the stars from, at least. And, like, there was this one particular star where you had to go explore an abandoned shipwreck. And, yeah, I just really hate drowning in video games. Oh, my God, it's becoming nighttime. Okay. That is not good. I was just yapping about Super Mario 64, and now it's becoming nighttime. Alright. Alright, I think that's enough birch logs. I know I said I'd get 16, but, uh, I think 14 should do the trick. I'm also gonna collect these birch saplings and sticks, so I can make more birch trees in case I need them for whatever reason. I believe I can make it to my house before I get killed by a bunch of mobs. Okay, it's like really late. I really hope no mobs try and kill me. Because that will be bad. Oh jeez, there's a zombie. Okay. Okay, think I have enough? Nice. Alright, now I'm going to go to bed. And I will see you all on day four of the Righteous Empire. Oh yeah, don't forget to stay righteous and subscribe.